In this video, I'm gonna show you how to add rounded corners to your clips, tweets, screenshots, whatever it is that you're working with in Premiere Pro. This gives the asset a much more sleek look in my opinion. To get started, I have this screenshot of a tweet on my timeline that I'd like to add the rounded corners effect to. I have some stock footage behind it, but if you wanted to add a solid color background instead, you can go to new item, color mat, click okay, then choose whichever color works best for you. For this example, I'll just choose white. Then you can name it if you'd like. I'll then delete the stock footage, then drag the color mat from the project panel onto the track below the tweets. And I'll just drag the color mat clip's end to extend its duration to match the tweet's duration. Now that we have the background we want, first thing we'll do to get the rounded corners effect is to go over to the effects panel and type in roughen edges into the search box. Then drag the roughen edges effect onto your screenshot. Now over in effect controls, underneath the rough and edges effect, click the drop down and choose cut as your edge type. Then increase the edge sharpness to 10. Below that, decrease the fractal influence to zero. And lastly, we're purposely saving editing the border for last since every clip or screenshot will be different. Slowly increase the border until you have the desired rounded corners you're looking for. In my case, I think 75, 76 looks perfect. Now keep in mind if Premiere is having trouble playing back the preview, for example if the yellow line was red instead, the corners of your screenshot may look weird and not rounded at all. But when you export it, it will look rounded and normal so you don't have to worry about that. Now we can consider ourselves done here, but if you're working with a dark mode tweet like this one and want to hide these three dots to make it look even more clean, here's what I do. First click new item again but this time click black video, then click OK. After that, drag the black video above the screenshot and extend its duration. Then while the black video is highlighted, go over to the effect controls panel and decrease its scale to something like 10, but you can adjust accordingly if need be. Then click motion at the top of the effect controls panel and drag the black video above the three dots. Easy, right? Thank you for watching, liking, and subscribing, guys. My Twitter is in my description if you want to follow me on there, too. And from here, I would suggest continuing on to this playlist for more Premiere Pro tips and tricks. But if you're mainly focused on using these rounded corner assets for short-form vertical content, continue on to this playlist instead. I'll see you there.